The world knows our first guest from a little show called Friends, but currently I just know her as my landlord. I don't consider me a landlord, I consider myself your roommate. Ellen DeGeneres explains why she's living in Courtney Cox's house. Meanwhile, Court says filming that long-awaited Friends reunion was so emotional. On Thursday's episode of The Ellen DeGeneres Show, the 63-year-old TV host who is married to actress Portia de Rossi dished on why she's currently crashing at her famous friend's pad. I'm not having marital troubles. I'm not out of my house because I'm... I'm not living with Courtney Cox because I'm kicked out of my house. So I'm, I'm, I, we sold our house here in Beverly Hills and I needed a place to stay and you were kind enough to, to say yes, stay at my house. And while the 56 year old friend star was happy to help out her pal, she admitted there have been a few bumps in the road. You're my style guru. So I was nervous about you staying there, being that I haven't redone it or it's just, I haven't been there in a year. So I had it cleaned and I moved everything off the right side of the bathroom so you'd have your space in the drawers. And, and I was just really ready for you. And all of a sudden it was like, well, wait a minute, Ellen's toothbrush is on my side. So essentially you're a terrible roommate. You took over my side <laughs> and your side. No. That was Portia who took over your side. Roommate issues aside, Courtney also dished that the highly anticipated Friends reunion special for HBO Max has finally been filmed. It was unbelievable. It was so emotional. Um, it's, you know, it's, it's an unscripted reunion, but we got to be on stage 24 for the first time, all of us, in like, I forgot how many years, 15 years or 17 years. And you know those famous opening credits? for a long time. It, uh, I don't know who, somebody thought that would just be really fun. And let me tell you what happens. It's not fun to be dancing in a fountain for hours and hours. Yeah, turns out it wasn't as joyful as it looked. I, I remember Matthew Perry saying at one point, and it didn't, we, didn't, we didn't know each other that well at that point, but I remember, and this is so Matthew, but he was like, can't remember a time that it wasn't in this fountain. The special was initially supposed to premiere with the launch of HBO Max on May 27, 2020, but had to be pushed back due to the pandemic. After the reunion was postponed, Friends co-creator Marta Kaufman told ET she wanted to wait to tape the special until a live studio audience could be part of the experience. We all want it to happen. Um, we're j we just have to wait until it's safe. I mean, this is a show, it is not scripted. Um, but this is the, the way this show works. We're going to need a live audience, need a live audience. Even if we socially distance that live audience, it really is a huge part of what Friends has been. Yeah.